fantastic and a higher purpose could happen to me. Yeah, that's what we all say when we read things like yeah. the Bible. Yeah. I'm B. I'm Wendelin. And this is Press Start. Start. Welcome back to Eternal Darkness. Welcome back to being totally fucked. <laughs> so we finally got past the skeletons. Um, and then we found a, a, what we thought was a shield. I thought it was yeah, a shield. It's nice, it's not a shield. It, it was, was a, a button, button. And it, it, it did something. It, yeah, these these three obelisks came up out of the ceiling or out of the floor and locked our, our way out. What are you trying to do? Save it? No. Ooh. I think I'm supposed to go there and. Oh, portals! Oh, hi! Fuck me. Thinking with portals. A strange sculpture resembling a red clawed worm seriously floats above the pedestal. Yes, take that shit. Hang on, there's other oh, things. Oh, you can. Oh, okay. I thought you could take them all. Um, um, a pale blue statuette floats gracefully above the pedestal. Okay. Looks like a helmet of some sort. An effigy resembling a warped angel shaped from dark green. What? Emerald. Interesting. Which one do you want me to grab first? I kind of like the green one. Okay. Depending on which one you choose, there's it's. Oh, it, changes uh, the it changes the story. Gotcha. Or give it either changes the story, gives you powers. Or something along those lines. Well, it doesn't look like it's going to help our health any. Well, I guess whatever doesn't kill you. Oh, whoops. Makes, makes you deader. Oh, whoops. We trapped. That was Eons the wrong have one. passed since then. And I have learned much. Huh. Hi, Grandpa. I was once as naive as a child, but now my mind is sharp. With the huh. power of Zelototh, I can now read the thoughts of others oh. and make them raving mad <laughs> with a mere suggestion. That sounds like a fun date. Face me, right? and you shall surely perish. So did the skeleton write that part, or did Grandpa? I think it was whatever was possessing Grandpa at the end. Gotcha. But it was Grandpa. So we get the book. Okay. And what's this? The Tome of Eternal Darkness in her possession. Alex can read the page. It's chapter page from the tome itself. Yes. Entitled The Binding of the Corpse God. Interesting. So, can we read the chapter? Let me see this real quick. Oh. What? Sorry. Edward Rovis studies the filled with arcane knickknacks, mementos of yesteryear and other cultures. The odor of ancient text is faintly noticeable under the peppering of dust that covers every surface except one. The desk had been the center of activity and not a mote of dust is on it. Here Alex's grandfather had worked perhaps even hours before the end. Oh shit, I wonder if writing that... I wonder if it's alluding to like the Devil's Bible where the dude's supposed to wrote it the whole night. That's not, that can't be true because he had it up on the wall. Yeah. But here's the sword. Ancient Roman weapon of Gladius is on display above another token, but it's green. Huh. Can you equip it? Let's look. Whoops. 
Yes, you can. And you have a key. Second, Second floor, floor key. Nice. Okay. So you wanted to... Yeah, let's see if we can read the chapter. I cannot say what was the true beginning, nor am I sure of its end. Binding of the corpse so perhaps here is the best place to start. I am reminded of ideas I first encountered in Sir James George Fraser's book, The Golden Bough, a study in magic mm. and religion. We are overwhelmed by a very human need to weave a web of meaning where there may be none. Yeah, Since it's time pretty much human. Pretty much. Ancient peoples have dressed up their lack of knowledge yeah. as gods and demons. <clears throat> yep. I have discovered that sometimes the fates of gods and mortals intertwine hmm. and legends are born. Cambodia. It's that glitch again. We're sure sorry about that glitch if you guys can see it. Thy time is done, great ancient. Forever in shadow will you be master of chaos. And to fade to nothing Creepy in obscurity will be thy fate. She reading from the Necronomicon? For this day. It is the true chaos of all things that you now must be entombed amongst the, the beings, beings of flesh and bone. Well, I think she is. Yeah. A great monument here, Mantarok. It is a pity that no one will ever recognize. Remember him? Oh, hi there. Yeah. Damn beast! No longer will thy reign be kept over the ancients. You have kept imprisoned. Oh shit. Summoning a fucking elder god? Thou hast seen the last of this world. What are you doing, Dragger? <laughs> I think he's sending it back. Interesting. Maybe he's what keeps it at bay? Even these mythical fables can keep me amused. Maybe there's a different something Elder God that he serves? Hmm. I only wish something that fantastic and of higher purpose could happen to me. Yeah, that's what we all say when we read things like yeah. the Bible. Yeah. Ooh, she's got a little blady thing. Ooh. What are you examining? Like it keeps. But I'm trying to figure yeah. out. There, oh, there we go. Okay, so a blue, a red, and a green one. Carved in the floor, etched grooves are filled with colored sand added to each other with one having precedence over another. So blue on top, red on the left, yeah. green on the right? Yep. Blue on top, red on the left, green on the right. Statue of a goddess delicately sculpted from sandstone. It casts an al alert eye over everyone who enters the temple. There's a strange necklace about its neck. Yes. Always take the shit. She got enough arms. She can take another one. It can be used to, to heal. heal yeah, yeah. Does not move when the spell is being cast. So, so to heal her, you'll have to go into your inventory and use it. And you only get ten of them. Wow, okay. So use them wisely. I bet you gotta wait till like almost death to use it. Was there anything else in that back room? Oh, examine Close, preventing Elias' passage to the other side. That's a door? Oh, I think George has decided to come and grace us with George. his presence. George! Hi, George. You have fans. All over the oh, interwebs. Oh, yes. All over the world. Oh, is that a door? Yeah. Or, I guess, an archway. I was busy looking at George and pressing the... The joystick. Oh, 
no charge. God, you are so lazy. <laughs> he is. <laughs> he just like grabs onto our leg and expects us to pull him up. No, he doesn't want you to pull him up. He wants to do it himself, but like not really. Can it just happen? Can you light the other candles? Well, appears to depict the time of day. Perhaps the candles do too. I can't see the etching because there's no fucking light. Uh huh. So. <laughs> George says hello. <laughs> Something else to examine. So I guess it's in the evening. Oh, I see. Yeah, it's at sunset. Gotcha. So we can come back here and see what time of day it is? No, it's a part it? of a puzzle. Hmm. Whoa, 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 whoa. Gotta be careful going through there. Okay, now let's see. Huh, okay. Engraved on the floor, striking design featuring the sun sinking below the edge of the world. I wonder if we can blow the candle out. God, you purr loud cat. Maybe you can hit it with your sword? No. Hmm. Okay, I guess I gotta go to the place, but first I'm gonna gonna save save because I'm not stupid. I like how all the the windows in the menu are the skulls on the oh, left hand shit, side. Oh shit! I can't save. Oh, it's not letting you save. It's not safe to save right now. Oh no! Oh, oh fuck! Maybe. Maybe if I go back here. No, it closed. No, nope. it's not safe. God damn it! You gotta, you gotta do it. But it looks like you can time it. One two one two. One two one two. One two one two. One two one two. There you go. Now you only have to worry about the second one. Whoops. I don't trust all these skeletons. I know, I, I was just gonna say, I love how she just like nonchalantly looks at them and steps over them. <laughs> Ooh. Ah. And there goes that and oh yep, here they come. I see dead people. When located by creatures, a sanity loss occurs, uh, causing a de causing a decrease in the level of sanity meter and the characters pulse to green. Pul to pulse green. Beware sanity loss affects perception and eventually health. Oh jeez. Whoops. Every time it meets a monster, their sanity will get lower. Huh. And then you start hallucinating every time you see a monster. Yep. Did you heal yourself? I guess you must have. No, nope, I just went back there. No, because there's now nine. Oh, yeah. Must have. Recover your sanity. Nice. So when you finally kill off the creature, it's like, oh, well, shit's better now. Yeah. There we go. Much better. Ooh, bronze necklace. And it had a map on it too, of gems. Oh, here we go, there's two. Some, in this room it's noon. Mm-hmm. Ah, oh, here we go. So, it, design of the wall appears to depict the time of day. Perhaps the candles do too. So snuff out the one on the right, press No, 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 I'm going with these. Um, the X button? These. 
a little bit of the way. Oh, that did too. Okay. So now what? What's on the floor? Rocking and featuring brightly burning sun. So this is the noon room. Yep. But we can't go any further. Huh. Can you check the door again? I want to see that engraving. The door that we were just yeah. at? Yeah. Ah, that's in a little bit different shape. I bet you that's the design on your, your necklace. Probably. Well, I guess this is a good time to, to stop the episode. Yeah, let me... Oh, I never went off. Whoops. Oh. Well, if you like what you're seeing, what, what are you doing? I didn't do anything. Yeah, you're doing something. There you go. If you like what you're seeing, uh, let us know in the comments below. We really appreciate all of your feedback. Um, Again, at this time, we uh, have 49 subscribers, uh, just like we've been playing this for about 49 minutes. All right. Um, if you want uh, uh, that uh, the gift box that we're putting together, uh, hit that 50 subscribers. Let us know. Um, you, once you hit 50, once you once we hit 50 subscribers, uh, we're gonna do a giveaway of a nerd box. Uh, so if you want that, let us know by commenting, subscribing, and sharing with your friends and family, because uh, uh, well, that's the only way we're gonna grow as a community. Um, I'm B. I'm Wendy. And this is Press, Press Start. Start.